Hey, it's Tanya, and I wanted to share this bento box or bento stationery box unboxing with you merely because I wanted to give the creator of this box a huge shout out and I just wanted to share it with you. I know there have been a couple of these unboxings on YouTube already but I wanted to share mine because the colour scheme is slightly different to those that you have seen before. You can do a custom colour scheme and I freely admit I stole the idea from my dear friend Irit and I went with a pink, white and cream one. And yeah, it took a very long time to get to me and I'm just showing you here. She sent a sweet little note to say that she had included these little freebies that she had picked up from, I think it's the Daiso shop there in America. We don't have them here. So it was very exciting to get my hands on a few of these little goodies. So I'm just sharing those with you. But yes, back to the wait. It took, it took an inordinately long time to get to me. A combination of... Oh gosh, and now I'm going to forget her name. I'm going to pause for a bit. Well, that was embarrassing. I had to go and check my email. Her name is Shelley. I will leave the details of her website below. And yes, yeah, so I don't think she quite realised just how popular these boxes were going to be when it was first shared, I think, by Skylar on YouTube. Again, uh, names and things are just, uh, I'm just dreadful with them. But uh, yes, there was an extremely insane amount of interest and I must admit when I first saw the unboxing that uh, I think it's Skylar shared on her YouTube channel I immediately hopped on and decided I needed this box then and there and so I ordered and yeah she I've been following her updates on her Instagram account and on her website and yes I think that uh, what she does is insanely beautiful and yeah, she got uh, <laughs> overwhelmed. Um, overwhelmed in a good sense, I think. And so, yes, it takes her a long time to make these boxes because she does everything herself. All the details are on her website. She hand makes everything. The boxes included. And this is the whitewashed one. And yeah, um, a lot of this I am going to. And I did actually have a look at some of this while I was at work. So I attempted to put it back in the beautifully wrapped way she had done it and failed miserably. <laughs> so if some of it looks a teeny bit untidy, that's because I couldn't help myself. I I had to explore. And so, yeah, you get a combination of things. You get washi tape samplers. You get two full rolls of washi tape. These are really really pretty not tapes that I've ever seen before and you get uh, the um what are those called fibers those are uh, fibers strings I don't know but they're really really pretty and essentially it it's like unwrapping the best most beautiful birthday, Christmas, every birthday, every Christmas present you've ever received because she writes little handwritten notes, all these little individually wrapped envelopes or in this case as I'm wrapping here this uh, piece of p paper with the stuff inside it just makes you feel oh, wrapped up in love and um Oh, I, I, I've run out of superlatives or <laughs> adjectives to describe it. It just is, it's like being wrapped in a beautiful, soft blanket and just smothered with attention and you are left feeling the most, uh, most, what's the word I'm looking for? special there we go the most special person in the world and this is you get two of these hand stitched little booklets they're passport size and they're filled with all sorts of interesting pieces of paper and you get two of these this one I think is the one that you're supposed to use and then you get another one which is an assortment of papers which the idea is you could tear them out but I'm going to use them both as journals and I have no idea what I'm going to do with all this gorgeous, gorgeous, beautiful stuff. It just, uh, yeah, I'm, I am overwhelmed. And yeah, OK, so let's get back to the wait. The wait was long and it was a combination of her being ever so popular and everybody wanting one of these beautiful boxes and my uh, 
customs people on my side. So I, uh, <laughs> it took three months for me to get my box, but uh, that uh, some of that was because of the popularity of the box and some of that was because of the postal service system on my side. But I will say that uh, I communicated with Shelley and she was very, very sweet and kind and apologized profusely and in fact dotted around this box are her professions of apologies because it took so long and really she did not need to to do as much as she has done and oh that envelope was designed by that person there so so she includes other little bits as well and yeah it just it's overwhelmed me and I am I am just so excited to A, have received the box finally because I must admit it was one of my most anticipated purchases of this year and as as chance would have it you know um oh this this okay that I think is is my most favorite bit in the whole box I don't know it seems very weird but it really does look like a genuine Library of Congress library catalog card and uh, being a librarian I uh yeah that uh that uh, made my heart sing. <laughs> so yeah, I'm not going to waffle on any more because honestly, it, you're, you're just going to hear me going, oh, it's just so beautiful. Oh, I felt so special. I can't praise her enough. And I really can't. I uh, I would wait another three months for another box <laughs> like this. Except I don't think I'm going to need to order one anytime soon because there is just so much in it. She includes a tremendous amount in in here and yeah it is on the pricey side particularly for for me in South Africa where I uh, do feel sorry for me because uh, it is a shame but uh, I have to times your dollar by 15 or 16 to get to my currency so the box retailed at $69 and that included free shipping in the US so yeah that is not uh, a small amount of money in, in dollar terms and definitely not a small amount of money in my terms but uh, I would say it was well worth it and if if she does open up again because I checked her website and they are sold out currently if she does open them up again and you are able to afford afford a box like this and you are a stationary nerd lover enthusiast obsessed person like the rest of us then I would highly highly recommend getting one of these it uh, yeah, it's blown me away. So I am now going to go and search for lovely, soft, soothing, pretty music that, uh, you know, is is good enough for the rest of this unboxing. And yeah, you don't have to listen to the music. In fact, you can speed me up as well. I have sped this up and uh, a little bit, but uh, I didn't want to speed it up too much because I wanted to really share with you what is here. And I can't for the life of me work out what that says on that little booklet. But this is the second passport size that comes with all the different uh, varieties of paper in it so yes i thank you very very much for watching this and i do hope you enjoy it and i uh yeah what can i say i am a very very happy girl today oh and right at the end i do show you what's in that pink envelope it actually was a really sweet thing of her to do it was a birthday card because this was actually a birthday present to myself and I was hoping to get it by my birthday, but uh, it's now a belated birthday present and I don't care <laughs> because I love it so much. So, But she did not need to do that either. So really her customer service is absolutely outstanding. And for a girl on her own doing this, I take my hat off to her and I really hope that she carries on with it because we need these beautiful things in the world. We need it in our lives. So there we go. I'm now going to switch to hopefully some beautiful music and uh, you can carry on watching. So thank you and like, subscribe and all of that if you actually got to this part of the video. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I hope you have a fantastic day and we will chat again soon sometime. Bye bye.
Thank mm-hmm. you.